I have four questions for you. Do you check your email today? Do you check your email? Raise your hand, please. Okay. Yesterday? And this week? Everybody, right. And do you check your uh, credit, uh, credit card or bank account? Today, not today, but this week? No. This month? <laughs> you don't? <laughs> okay. This year? <laughs> you do. Okay. Do you check your electricity bill? <laughs> no? This week? No. Yeah, you do. Right. Congratulations. <laughs> and this month? This year? Very few of... Okay. I don't. I don't check my electricity bill this year, I have to say. But I know the electricity bill of the SNCF, the big transportation company. I know the electricity bill of ArcelorMittal or, or a, a lot of big companies in this country, in fact. And it's stupid. It's stupid for me and it's stupid for you and it's stupid for our society. And I will explain that to you. This TED is about a dad, me, and my kids. And I will explain. On this Wednesday, when I leave home, I move across the flat and I, I check all the light in all the room. And all the light were on. So I switch off all the light and I say, okay, I, I'm, I'm a great guy. I take care of the climate change. But I am stupid because just before I close the door, during 10 seconds, I just switch on the washing machine. And it's stupid, completely stupid. It would be better to let all the light on and don't switch on the machine machine, the washing machine. And I will explain that clearly for all you guys. The question is, when you are at home and you want to check your electricity bill, you just look the electricity meter. And the electricity meter told you only one thing. Because when you set a new home, you plug a new meter and you start to count from the beginning up to now. And when you check your electricity bill, you just have the difference between the last check and the, the, new, the, the check today. And you, ju you just measure the difference. This is how we manage electricity today in our house. And it's stupid. Because kilowatts, it's not the only one data we need to manage the climate change. What for? OK. This is the, the two big parts of our consumption here in France and in all the country. There is the housewife, Madame Michu. She is nice. We are Madame Michu. I am Madame Michu every day at home. I cook, I open the fridge, I take a beer, of course, and sometimes I watch the TV with the beer. Just imagine a football match, for example. I didn't care about what I did exactly with the electricity bill when I, when I live in my house every day. But every day I, I leave house, the house and I go to work. And I can tell you exactly for this load curve, load curve sorry, uh, which company is behind because it's my business. And we know exactly the consumption of all this company. 10 minutes after 10 minutes, we know exactly. We know exactly the power, and the power is measured by kilowatt, OK? It's just a reminder for everybody. And the energy consumption is measured by kilowatt per hours. And the kilowatt per hours is the area on this graph, and the power is the just a level at a certain time. Okay, just a reminder because I know it's sometimes a bit difficult. Okay, so the point is for each industry here, I know exactly 10 minutes after 10 minutes the consumption. But Madame Michu, we don't know. I mean, me as dad, 
I don't know exactly at each moment of the day what is the conception is my in my house. And in fact, after my question, you don't know your conception, not at all. And it's a pity because you know this curve, th this road curve here for Madame Michu, you don't know this curve. Nobody knows. This is the average conception of all the people in France in their house. But we just measure the kilowatt hour between a moment to another. Usually between a bill you have to pay to another bill you have to pay. And you just sh have to cry between these two periods, this during this period of time. Okay, move forward. Do you understand what is the problem? During f four decades, the conception of Madame Michu grow 20 fast, f 20, 20 faster than the conception of the industry. The industry grew by 30% and Madame Michu grew its conception by 600% and you don't know. And it's a pity. The climate change is based on this stupid management of the energy in our country and in all the society. And we have the we have to change that for your future and for your kids. The point is that this energy conception is for your pleasure and for your uh, comfort at home. But understand that the industry in this country is a bit here, actually. For example, I signed a contract to help a company to, um, to manage the uh, consumption of electricity during this winter in Brittany. And this company is Tilisabco. And Tilisabco is not uh, a company who is uh, working very well, actually, in fact. And the reason is because the price of the energy, the price of the um, of all the, 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 the workforce and such things are very high and we have to manage all this to make this company competitive. And Madame Michu is, is a factor of that. Why? This, this is, the, the, this is a, a week and this is the consumption of electricity in our country. So look at this curve and just check the curve of Madame Michu. It's quite the same. It's quite the same because Madame Michu is using electricity during the peak hours. And the peak hours are produced by thermal plant, and, uh, th thermic plant, sorry. So you, need, you don't need nuclear power plants to produce the peak load. You need, um, you need hydraulic and you need coal and you need uh, oil and it costs a lot. And this price is the same is, is the same for all the company in this country, but the price for uh, you at your home is only one price during the period, but you, you don't have a clear uh, understanding of that price because you just have one or two or three price but you don't have the price on the market, the spot price. It's not your price for you. This is the price for the company. And the spot price for the company is very high. Sometimes it's 300 euro per hour for one megawatt. Okay, so the electricity for the electricity sector time is really money. When you switch, when I leave my house and I switch off the light, the, the consumption of the light is very low in your house. As you can check on, 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 this, uh, on this scheme, the lighting is not so expensive, not so important in your home, home consumption. But the consumption for your washing machine is very high. All the, the washing machine, uh, the fridge, and such things, it's 50% of your consumption. So when I switch on, stupidly, the washing machine on Wednesday, it was at the very bad 
moment of the day because uh, it was around six and seven um, in the morning and the price is very high. Be why? Because all the industry switch on to process the project. So it was not a good time. So time is really money in this electricity industry. On Madame Michu, his impact is really high. It's more than two thirds of full consumption. Okay, this is the price. This is the price on the spot market for our country. And this is a week, and Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, okay, this is the week. And the difference between the off peak and the on peak is really high in terms of price. So it's really high for the company and for all the people, in fact, because we use coal, we go use gas, we use uh, oil. All this um, production is very uh, cost is is very expensive. But we can change that. Why? Okay, just just a point. We measure electricity with kilowatt hours. But now we have the opportunity to change this world, to very change the, the way we use electricity because we need more information and we have the opportunity to do that because we have technology. And kilooctet with kilowatt hour all together can give us the way to change the way of uh, consumption or of use electricity. It's a new paradigm. In fact, in her house, we can connect all the device with the electricity network, exchange information. This is the machine-to-machine -machine technology. I mean, when I leave my house on Wednesday, if I just switch my washing machine, but with one information, I will come back home tonight at 6 o'clock p.m. and I let the machine m make the, the the washing during this lapse of this in the period of time. The network and all the system can exchange data together and my washing machine will not start at 6 or 7 o'clock in the morning. It will start probably later in the day at a period of time when electricity is cheaper. And we have all the technology to do that. We just have to choice, change your habit. It's simple. All the technology is there. And what we can do with that? Just, we have the peak load. Uh, we have two peak during the day a peak at the beginning of the day and a peak at the end of the day when all the housewife come back home switch on the cooking and when the worker are still in the factory and work again so we can move some consumption of electricity before or after and we can change the load curve flat the load curve and if we flat the load curve we flat the price. Why? Because we stop using coal, oil, on cost-effective um, electricity, pro electricity production. And this is the way. The way is not just to switch off. It's just to change your habit, your behavior, and to move some consumption to a period of time to another. And because we are not at home, technology can help us to do so, can you see it? Okay. So, the new paradigm is that kind of technology, of course. We need to have some computer on each device, not just to program all the devices. Uh, I, d I don't know do that, and I don't want to spend all my time at home to program all the, the washing machine, the, tele the TV seat, and such things. It's stupid. I don't want to do that. But I, I want that uh, the machine discuss all together and can plan 
the good period of time to process. This is the technology that can allow us to do that. Okay, so now I have just one message. Save your energy. This means you switch off and you switch on at the correct period of time and you buy the technology. Okay? So it's your problem and it's mine too, as dad, of course. Thank you very much.